Bitcoin is at breaking point and there are some opportunities for some huge trades right here. As you can see, right now we're about to break out of this, this kind of flag formation, right? Now, I always say, I'll always say to people, don't chase these formations, right? Don't don't ever chase these these flag formations and and stuff like that. So um, what's the opportunity? Okay, if we can have a look here, we're just about to break out at about 27,122. In fact, I might put on a lower time frame for a little bit more suspense, right? Now, this does leave some opportunities for trades. Realistically, if we're looking for long-term time frame trades and short-term time frame trades, there are two different opportunities. Opportunity number one is actually a short, right? Reason being is because if we go to crypto rank, and I recommend a lot of you guys go over to here, right? Check out Bitcoin and then look at the monthly chart, right? The, it's, it's called the monthly ROI. Something interesting has happened which hasn't happened for a long time with Bitcoin. It's been a while since we've actually seen profit in September. Does this mean that October is going to be red? Or does this mean that October is going to be green? Now, if I was placing my bets here, I would say on the long term side of things, if you look at the majority or well, the majority of October has been profitable. And if you do look at the whole market here and we look at you know our list, if you look here, Everything is starting to, to, to peak up a little bit. Everything is starting to turn around. You know, even tokens which haven't really seen any movement. Uh, so, so for example, like, like FTM is looking like it's about to break out. And we're looking at a potential edge to edge trade on FTM, by the way, on the daily. Now, if we look at Bitcoin, even Bitcoin from October 1st, looks like it's about to just pop a, pop a dildo, right? So what does that mean? Short term wise? we could potentially look for a short from the cloud area here. So that would be about 27,488. The reason is, is because a lot of people are going to be looking for longs. They're going to be looking to long the breakout here. And a lot of people are going to be looking for shorts to be looking to play this range here for us to break down, okay? Now, that, that means that there's going to be a ton of trades and liquidity trapped in this area here. There's gonna be longs trapped, there's gonna be shorts trapped, and everybody's looking for October to be kind of a volatile month. So that does mean that if we look for higher points, so if we look at different parts, such as this pit, this part here, right, which is also the orange line, I'm not gonna overcomplicate it with these Chinese names, but the orange line and the cloud here, this red area, we can look for a scalp short from 27,400, or alternatively, we could look for a retest of this range. So for example, I wanna make these lines actually a, a little bit bigger as well. So allow me to make these a little bit more clear for you guys. Let's make it a little bit, let's make it like that, boom. Okay, so now we could wait for a retest to the downtrend here and then for us to go. Okay, personally, I wouldn't necessarily go with a, a long straight off of the butt, like trying to long the breakout because you can get trapped. Like you really can get trapped in this part. There's been so many times, like if you go back, I don't want to take up too much of your guys' time, but if you literally take the time to go back throughout the chart and you look at, for example, BTC over the past five years, and you actually do look at all the times we, we've played these types of flags, a lot of times, as you can see, even right here, when we came down to 19,700 in March 2023, it was a similar similar thing. You've got a pattern, but then we completely break the pattern to trap longs and shorts and basically catch a lot of stops in that area. OK, so as always, guys, to remind you, for those of you guys that are new, the strategy that we're playing out with, which is what has made me the most money, is looking at a long term time frame. Right now, we are in the mid cap area so we're not looking at small market cap altcoins we're only looking at early stage opportunities like private sales and we're looking at larger market cap altcoins uh like obviously bitcoin ethereum we'll maybe looking a little bit like polka dot you know just anything of, of a larger market cap right all of the the larger market caps out there 
I personally believe that we've already seen the low for Bitcoin as throughout history, we've always seen the low for Bitcoin two years before BTC halving. So every single time, two years before BTC halving, we've seen the low for Bitcoin. That doesn't mean that we can't get close if there's a black swan event, but it does mean that the best prices for Bitcoin have already been set, which means when we're looking at trades right here, we can go through and we can look at tokens like FTM. And we can look at tokens like even Gala Games. We can look at tokens like Atom and we can say, okay, if October is going to be a bullish month right here, right, then what does that mean even for tokens like Atom? That means that we could be seeing Atom also turn around right here, right? So you should be very, very focused right now as a crypto investor and you should be looking for some of these larger market cap altcoins and just larger market cap tokens to make trades on following that BTC is scheduled for a large month. So just to rehash right here on the smaller time frames, you can look for a few scalp shorts from uh, from the top of the range up here, right about 27,400. If you're looking for longs, it's not the time just yet, but what you can do is you can wait for a retest. So be patient. I know social medias are gonna go crazy this week because it's, it's October, it's the beginning of October and you're gonna to start to see movement, but be patient, wait. And if you wanna know some of the best exchanges, I've had tons of comments, just check the description down below and you can find the best exchanges. Take care everybody, peace, and I wish you guys a lot of luck and prosperity in this month of October.